back here, boy. I ain't done with you yet. Urgh. Oh my god! Hey guys, the air conditioner here because why not? Welcome back to some more Man Eater where we are actually nearing the end of the game. So last time, if you caught it, we uh, basically binge finished the whole infamy tree. So we're pretty much done with that entire branch of the game and everything else is eh, everything else is uh, almost uh, fully done except for this spot, which is 16% done even though I have everything completed. So this might be the final, final area. And we'll see what happens with that, but we have like the story to just quickly finish here uh, We need to kill the apex of here and here and obviously the final spot there But yeah, I I think we're almost done with this game like an episode or two more and we'll be pretty much golden So right now we got to go check in on Pete and see what he's doing ever since we uh <clears throat> Blew him to hell. So here we go oh, There we go Pete what's in the barrels? Fish fool. Pete, whatever this is, can I ask you not to do it? I'm gonna get that shark. One way or another. Shark shark? It's, it's just that this is unnecessarily destructive. I mean, it's just one shark. There's a whole ecosystem. One shark? That killed my boy. Jesus. Pete, look. Look what we did to him. Wanna keep tugging on this knot, you? God, we made him into Two-Face. Jesus Christ. Okay, there you go. Well, hello there. Ooh, a little play on words there. Check in on Skelly Pete again. Yeah, because we already, like, binge rushed and finished everything, so we might be able to just instantly rush and check him out again, wherever the heck the notification is. Oh, it is that way, which is in the middle of this area. Oh, so I have to go unlock the grotto there. So let's just quickly beeline it there. Because, I mean, I don't remember if I actually showed this on camera, these areas or not. Because, I mean, they're cool, but... Again, it's like... Th this game, like, as I'm, like, recording this and stuff, it feels so much like it's, like, the perfect game to stream. Because you get to see all the lights and other stuff like that. But if you're showing that in, like, a video it would be like hours long and you know you're, it, it's repetitive but in like a fun way ish oh a final boy grab that yeah oh and we got this little boy who wants to try to mess with us there we go he did all right so not that way we gotta go around but like i mean it, it's cool but i don't know maybe i just haven't found like the sweet spot for it and i mean ironic given we're almost kind of done with the game but I don't know. It's 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 an interesting little game, and it's like how I record these is I like play these every like week ish or so to something like that. this area is to witness Mr. the ability of the hydrosphere to support the growth of humanized landscapes along the Gulf. Yada yada. I'm, I'm not gonna miss you interrupting me, but uh yeah no, it's like for me like it, it I don't feel the repetitiveness because I play it so like long in between, I guess you could say. But I'm just imagining, like, because I, personally, I marathon, like, li uh, not live streams, but, like, long series, and I feel like Mr. Narrator. God damn. I swear to God, if you're in this game, you get an eight. Like this goddamn parrotfish. Yeah, like that. But, uh, yeah, no, it's like, I feel like it would be kind of repetitive, almost boring-ish, to just, like, see, like, the same thing over and over, because it really, has, at its core, is kind of identical, but it's like a fun identical. I don't know what I'm trying to get at, but only here, here we go. We unlock this. The miracle of self love. Self love, yada yada. And now we have just a few quests. I'll probably just do one of these, and we'll just skip right to uh, where the uh, what's it called? Pete is, because he seems like he's gonna do a, a big bad. Where I guess we're not gonna be the monster, because. Yeah, we ate a bunch of people, but he maybe systematically destroyed an entire whole ass ecosystem. You know, just because his son died. I mean, yeah, we, you know, we did blow his son up. That is, that's my bad. But in my defense, I was trying to eat his son. So, you know, that's different. You got a Orca defending the turtles? God damn. What I tell you, Free Willy? Just ate oh my, we can pick up the Orca now. Jeez. We really- we are the Meg now. Oh my god, we got 
so many things. We have two sharks, three sharks, and an orca. Oh my god! Oh jeez! They're beating my ass! I just got freaking yeeted out of the water! John Free Willy! There we go, there's one of the sharks left. Now it's just me and you, boy. Oh, sure. Bad! He's, he's... Oh my god, if he's not even doing damage to us, I just noticed our health. Get back here, boy! I ain't done with you yet! Oh my god! Ow! Just smack me in the... Can you imagine the guy just hanging out in that uh, car right there? He just sees that, just a shark get absolutely launched. Bitch slapping an orc. Oh my god, I think we drowned him. Well, ain't so free no more. God damn, it's been way too long since I've seen uh, Free Willy. I'm making, making all these Free Willy jokes, even though I haven't seen the movie in years. That's um, that's that's gonna be my next project for myself. I got I gotta watch that movie. One more turtle, and then that'll be this area. Turtle numbers Pretty much exploded. done. Bad news for seagrass, great news for orcas who enjoy torturing and eating them. Huh. I didn't think orcas ate, uh, sea turtles, but I guess you learn something new every day. River food consume 10 humans, and then kill a, a special orca. Ooh. Actually, let's go quickly kill that one, and then I'll just go do the other two real quick, because it's like, the quests are fun, but it's like, the only thing more annoying than... Or boring, I guess you could say, than grinding is watching someone grind. I feel like I said that before already. But, where is this boy? Okay, here we are. Took a minute, but, ooh, it's a big, like, ocean wall. I'm guessing that's to prevent the sand from, like, sliding out and just destroying whatever buildings are there. Alright, so, the Haunted Orca. Alright, you look pretty cool. Never mind. You're gonna be an easy kill. Oh my god, he smacked me in the face. I mean, cool design though. I love it. It looks like almost like a penguin orca, if you will. Ow! Oh my god! Oh! Stop smacking me! This is like the third time today! The I just wanna kill you dead! Circle the globe in constant motion. God damn, Orca! Go and die! Oh my god, he hits like a tank! To complete that game. Yeah. Frozen herring and fish fingers. Casanita just wants her favorite comfort Whoa. food. Raw shark liver. Alright, there we go. And done. Okay, so that's that done. I'm gonna quickly go binge finish the rest of these real quick. So I thought this was gonna be like the final boss area. I think the gulf is gonna be. Just cause 33%. Uh, I didn't factor in all the quests that need to actually open up. Like, this area is 100% done, 100% blah, 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 blah. And the Gulf, we have yet to get any of these missions yet. So, the Gulf is probably definitely going to be the final area where we might fight Moby Dick. We might find it, uh, fight the True Meg. Or something like that. But, uh, yeah, so I'm going to quickly go bang that out. And then we'll probably check up on Pete and see how he's doing. Okay, so that was uh, quite a bit of grinding. But we are ready to go and fight the Apex, which is right over here. I'm not even going to say what it is, but I will tell you that the reward for actually killing it is the final piece of the puzzle. We get the bonehead for it, so we can be fully bonafide, which hopefully 99,000 uh, minerals is enough to actually like upgrade us so we can do it without me having to go grind for like six hours. But yeah, it's in there. So once we go through this yeah, all right, this is the correct way, because the other side's actually blocked. But here the we go. Along Let's wait for is frequently this described goddamn as narrator. Which reminds me, I could go for another Singapore sling. Blah, blah, blah. All right, hold on. Three, two, one. Come on. There it is. The Look at that thing. The orca. Look at that monster. All right, let's go kick its ass. You're a big boy! I don't give a sh- Oh my god! You're a thick boy! That's a big boy! Oh my god! Oh! Oh Jesus! Oh my god! He got me! He got me! Oh! Oh, I haven't been grabbed like that in a while! Ah, oh, finally something that's a worthy opponent! Oh my god! 
behind you. Ugh. Finally, I've been fighting stuff that is just so easy for the longest time. An actual challenge. Let's go gamer mode. Yeah. We get our own kick-ass soundtrack. Ugh. Oh god, thank god we have nothing but bone. Oh, oh my god, oh my god. Ugh. Let me go. Ugh. Oh, did I hit him? I think I did. Eh. Eh. Oh my god! Ugh. Jesus. Oh god. We're like just yeeting each other. There we go. Oh, we stunned him. Almost got, like, got a spin off. Come on, baby. Fail me now. He's starting to slow down, he's starting to get tired. Oh my god! Oh, he's trying to like combo it where he knocks us into. Oh my god! We got him! He's gonna drown! Wait, workers of mammals! Oh, you goddamn mammal taking this on land then! Orcas, yeah! Attraction at Marine mammal Park, we got him! Now have a new favorite trick killing things. Oh my god! Alright, so. He actually was, when he was knocking us in the air, he was trying to combo like it and grab us. Out of water, sharks have trouble on land. Oh my god, let me free! Oh my, oh god, I thought we were stuck. Oh, okay, so, we have the bonehead, but we also need to visit the grotto. Final grotto is brought to you by Millennia Blah Blah. Well, I mean, that's perfect, because we actually need to literally go there to level up our face and then we'll be the full bone shark we'll get the full bonus for all the kits and stuff and i was thinking like i could go through and like showcase all the different like full what's it called uh builds or whatever but i mean there's probably hundreds of videos like that already because i mean yeah th this game is a bit oldish now at this point but we we've been playing through it i've been having fun and i, I think that's all that matters is you enjoy it so yeah, I mean, maybe if you guys want to see that, or maybe at the end, if we have enough points left over, I'll try to max out a build or something like that. Because I think, instead of having like this be like a two-episode thingy or whatever, warm waters this the narrator. Across the Atlantic, towards English seaside towns filled with cranky pensioners, donkey rides, and heroin addicts. Yeah, heroin-addicted donkeys. We get it. Okay, so, yeah, no. Basically, instead of going like with like two videos or something, I think this will be the final. We'll just, we'll just cram it all in, one big mega awesome end it all, instead of just, you know... Try not to draw it out any longer than it needs to be. Because, I mean, there's a bunch of other series and stuff I want to do and things. From the stern and I need more of a, uh, like, a, a more of a reason to, fo like, force myself that, hey, you don't have that one series to record. D get off your ass and finally learn that OBS thing so I can do, uh, Dokes Bros and play that monkey game that I mentioned a while back. Okay, so, we have the head. Bone head. Oh my god. Look at our eye. We get bones on our eye! Jeez, what do the other ones look like? Ah, oh, that's lame. That's... eh. The bone one's the best. I think we chose the best build. Alright, get it? Upgrade? Yes, please. Upgrade again? Yes, please. Upgrade again? Yes, please. And finally... Done. That's it. Look, we even get like a... Almost like... Some impromptu beard-ish. There we go. That's the bone shark. Fully maxed out, beefy, bony boy. Amazing. Alright, so let's get a look at this thing. Oh. Oh. Oh, God. I don't know if you guys see that, but look inside the mouth. That's like a second ma We got two ma We're like some sort of alien thing. That's horrifying. Jesus Christ. Alright, anywho. Now, I'm feeling strong. Let's check our stats. Just mass all the way up. Defense maxed. Health could be better. Damage could be better. But we are, if there's a boat, killing it easy. All right. So we have oh, consume five humans. Destroy the target. And swimming with the sharks. Kill ten hammerheads. That's getting kind of crazy. But um, are we close to any of these? Um, Consume. Wait, why is it only five? Hold on. This one might actually be cool enough to uh, show you guys instead of me just doing it off camera. If it is what I'm thinking it is, which I'm thinking with my little brain noodle, that we gotta kill him on that thing. I Meaning we gotta invade this big boy. Oh no, they're just divers. 
Dang. I wanted to actually get on there and see if we can wreck some stuff. Yeah, no, they're just they're just hanging out, just being divers. Dead. Dead. When the sound of shotgun Molly Hatch disturbs the dead. serenity of an otherwise calm sea. This guy didn't even notice his friends are dead. We've been some real bad fish tears because of these oil tankers spinning. But it brings a lot of money into the economy. Can't argue with that. I mean, yeah, what's a few billion dead fish for, you know, some more beer tokens or whatever. Anywho, uh, that's the end of this. Pretty much. We just got a whole bunch of kill humans and stuff. And I'll just go quickly do that because these, if you see how easy that was, yeah, that's why I like to cut things out because, yeah, it's like the whole like five minute journey over there for a three second quick little kill and it doesn't matter. So, uh, here we go. Okay, so, oh my god, that was a lot of grinding and fighting, like, strong-ish things. And we even had to fight a hunted sperm whale, so I had a cool little texture, but that's not the main sperm whale we're after. I was right, at least partially, I I think. it It's albino looking! We might got ourselves some sort of our own version of Moby Dick, which, uh, I saw this really funny picture, like, years ago, and I've been always wanting to use it. It was like this thing where, uh, I have it actually open to my right here, uh, yeah, no, it's basically, like, these two stick figures, this guy's, like, asking this girl out or something like that, and it's like, oh, my boyfriend wouldn't like that, and then her boyfriend shows up, but it's Moby Dick, <laughs> and he's just like, my god, so I'll try and, uh, see if I can get this, like, how I envision my head and not sound cringy or something like that. There it is! The cetacean assassin. My the god. Whale. Split your lungs with blood and thunder! If you wish to prevail- No, wait, no. When you see the white whale, break your backs and crack your oars, men. If you wish to prevail, this ivory leg is what propels me. Harpoons thrust in the sky. Uh, wait, what does it say? Aim directly for his crooked brow and look him directly in the eye. White whale! Holy grail! Yeah! No, it was cringy! I was wrong! <laughs> Alright, whatever, it sounded better in my head. But either way, oh my god, look at how messed up he- He has an anchor in his ass! No, his tail! Oh god! Yeah! Crack him in the face! Get some over dick! Yeah! Oh my god! White whale! Holy grail! God, look at his red demon eyes! Die, Moby Dick! Yeah. Level six. He's double our level. Yeah. Come on. Oh my god, it's a big mumbo jumbo. He is not playing nice. We're already half health. We, we're the Meg ourselves. We shouldn't be half health. The world practically ran on sperm oh, bam. Now We got it. Cringy as they meant. Oh god. That Has that may have been. Ah, oh, God, that was cool. Sounded a lot better in my head, but you know what? We don't learn unless we try things in life, so. Get a look at, uh, Scaly Pete's new vessel. Sure thing, we killed Moby Dick, we killed everything. There's nothing left for us to do, but I think take the fight to this boy himself. So, we'll just take a nice casual swim. Possibly our last in this great big underwater domain where everything the light touch everything the water touches is my land all right here we go in like five four three two one yeah and then loading screen of course <laughs> oh, oh, we're, we're back as a new book right. and from the looks of it there are several features probably not legal for civilian use. What's he have like a like an HG on it? Is that a nuke? No, that's a, that's a. Wh why is so my brain having a me. lapse? What's happening? So what? Uh, Torpedo. That's what they're called. Pete, I, I don't know what all this is, but you're scaring us. <laughs> what you got to be scared about? You a shark? Uh, Pete, I don't want to, but I, I think we need to get the police, maybe the, the Coast Guard. Get involved. the Navy. <laughs> you think I'm crazy? I'm, uh, I'm the most sane man you ever seen. Look, I didn't get it easy. But when some, some shark <laughs> take everything I got, 
I give her the same chance she gave my boy. None! But we did blow his child now up. Get you know. the f off my boat before I kill you too. The f I say! <laughs> Hope you got a hunger on! We serve a shark to fair tonight! That sounds French. Oh god, we're in trouble. Pete has built an impressive battleship. But will it be enough to endure the prehistoric might of a mega shark? Mega shark. All right. Take on Pete and his refurbished World War II era attack vessel. God damn, no, so I guess this is our final uh, swim. Let's just take in the sights as we travel in. Our final battle. I mean, we're as leveled up as we can get. Besides that new upgrade, which I don't even know what it was. Hostile fish smaller than 50% of your size are neutral neutral to me. So we are just king then. I mean, that's more of a cool thing, but not really for us and our whole, you know, fighting god, basically. Wait a minute, can we, like, jump this? Or do I have to go around? Oh, they got them futuristic laser shields. God, I wish we could have sunk some sort of oil thing. That would have been, that would have been cool. There it is. Here we go. All this land. They're all gonna see this out in the open. As we kill his big ass boat. Wonder if we'll get another cutscene or we're just diving straight in. Find out in like three seconds. No, there we go. Hello there, girlie. As you can see, I came prepared today. How prepared you talking, boy? You going to get turned into shark chow? Oh, that's electricity. That's not cool. Pete's last stand. All right, let's go. Let's get him, boy. Yeah. I gotta get on his boat so I don't get electrocuted. Oh my God! Look at that. Wait, can we break that? Okay, no, that's hurting. That's hurting. Oh my God. Jeez, it looked like we could damage that, but I don't know. Seal, I need you. Get over here, you medkit. There we go. Just apply some uh, seal healing. Th oh my god, what is that? Oh god, I thought that was like a nuke or something. No, it's just a small bomb. We're good. I just went through that grouper. Oh. oh, I thought I could like grab it and throw it back at him. Apparently not. Oh, come up. Come up with everything just to come with a gray maca boy. There we go, now we're on it. Smack it, smack it, damage it. Do as much damage as we can. Oh, nope, we're about to die, we're about to die. Ooh, getting close. Uh, seal. There we go. Uh, 50 cc's, cc's of seal will heal almost any wound. What's that sound? Oh, oh, oh my, what was that like 180 turn it just did? He has hacks on his side. My God. Oh, that hurt. Give me that. Thanks for sending me some uh, help. Uh, wait, I have radar. What am I doing? Oh, okay, I don't know how to dodge those. We gotta get some help. Yep, it does hurt. I understand, Pete. I know your son's dead, but blowing up a shark ain't gonna bring him back. Turtle, quickly, we gotta get the seal. Ooh! 750! That was pretty that was pretty good. I think that's how we're gonna damage him. Gimme your missile. Come back. Oh, or not. Oh, little diver. Does it come with missile repel? Ow! Okay, never mind. Ow, that hurt. No, oh, don't shoot me in my head. Little do you know, my friend. Okay, I'm trying to make a funny quip here, but I keep messing it up. Uh, fire. Uh, uh, fuck. Uh, uh, no, I was gonna say fire back. None of these are gonna work. All right, screw it. He doesn't want me to make crude, horrible jokes. Um, no, damn it. I guess we can't hit it from the front. Whatever. Screw it. We're just going balls deep. Alright, let's go! What the hell? Whoa, what? 
reinforcements. reinforcements. What the hell is that? Oh my god, he had the power to turn it to daytime! Some crazy reinforcements. Man from cutscene is now sharp. Oh, we have to kill these guys. Alright, nothing I haven't done before. And these guys are nothing. I've killed both of like two times the size of you, boy. Let's actually kick our own, our own little fight. Delete it. There we go. Where is you? Get over here. You, you, oh my god, we ate his legs! Ow! Hey, I'm eating here, that's rude. Uh, Pete, where you at, bud? Oh, uh, there you are, friend. Ow. Oh, I want to missile you so badly. Oop. Badoosh! Okay, so I think I know how to, we have to, like, run from it. Somebody get down there. Ooh! I think I'm trying to dodge that. How's it going, Petey boy? I eat your hunters. Here we go, got that one. Oh, wait, you gotta get out of here. Oh, oh my god, oh my god. And... Ooh. Ooh, I'm so sorry I hit you in the head. That was meant for the boat. Seal, seal, seal. Need somebody to get in the water with. Yeah, Badoosh! Yeah! I think we got him. Oh, we got a loading screen. That that seems like a good sign. I, I think we did it. Here we go. Your time's over, Pete. Scaly Pete. Get into my second mouth. Uh-oh. Laissez le bon temps rouler. Oh no. I suppose there's a lesson to be gleaned here. Something about how the increasing commodification of the natural world has placed humans on a collision course with an environmental apocalypse. But this is a basic cable show where people tune in to watch sharks kill people, and people kill sharks. So until next fishing season, this is Man Eater. Well, that's all she wrote. There you go. Fun game, I gotta say. That was uh, interesting. I'm gonna uh, probably see if I can try to quit to menu or hold a skip. What happens if we do that? Because I, I want to give my two cents on the game. All right. Finish the main story. You may continue to eat and grow and evolve. Jawsome. Player progress. Mega evolutions found. 13 hours. God damn. All right. So that's pretty cool. So um, this has been a man eater. Uh, thank you for sticking around if you've watched every last episode. I hope you enjoyed and wait a minute. Wait a god. 98%? What the hell did I miss? Alright, I'll have to uh, do that after or something like that. Anyway, uh, but yeah, no, so thank you if you uh, watched throughout uh, everything. Uh, let me know what you enjoyed the most about it, what your fa favorite episode was, because I tried to kind of make it where uh, it was like each episode was kind of its own thing-ish, because like, there, yeah, there's a story, but it really was just kind of mindless violence and stuff like that. And, I don't know, it, it was fun. I, I enjoyed this game, but I can totally see how you could easily get burnt out with, like, the repetitiveness if you played it in one foul swoop. So, yeah, I mean, I guess my that's probably my only note about this game. It's just, like, it's a little repetitive in that regard, but aside from that, it's pretty good. So, uh, yeah, I got really nothing else to say, really, because I'm not really that good at giving reviews the I guess, in front of an audience, because, uh, I'm weird, where it's like, I'll, I'll watch a movie, and then I'll, like, pace back and forth in my room for, like, 30 minutes, uh, you know, giving a full, in-depth review just to myself. I, I, I guess that'll, uh, come with time of, I don't know, building that YouTube confidence or something like that. Where the hell is the 98%? What am I missing here? 
Where is it? Where the hell is it? Oh, there's some freaking humans? Oh, hell no. Okay, here we are. One last job before we end the series and uh, just absolutely finish on a nice strong 100% note of human death and murder for polluting the oceans and making the water go from blue to poo. And done. There we go. Funding a diving expedition every year for 10 years, and I ain't found it yet. 100% complete. There you go. I don't think you get anything special except for the satisfa satisfaction of uh, saying you complete it. There you go. After party. Is there like a, a secret quest? Nah, I don't think there would be. Maybe I'm missing something, maybe I'm not. Either way, that will have to end it here for uh, since I actually did my great return video and stuff like that, our first ever series complete. Uh, so yeah, let me know what you think about it, and I hope to only improve on doing series as time goes on, because, I mean, there's a lot of things that I still want to do with, like, YouTube and stuff like that, but, I mean, I'm also still kind of trying to upgrade my YouTube confidence and stuff like that, because it's weird. It's like, the second I hit record, it's like confidence drops by 20 points. It, it, I don't know, I can't really describe it, but it's weird. And it, I don't know, I feel like it, I'm holding myself back from a lot of jokes that I'd like to be making. I don't know, I, I can make these funnier, I feel, but it'll take time. And I don't know, I mean, I learned a whole bunch of cool stuff as I was going throughout this uh, series. Uh, thanks to a lot of you guys as well, so thank you for that. And yeah, I guess, all about its rogue shark. yeah, that's right just about all she wrote. Like the video if you enjoyed, subscribe for more, and I will see you uh, in the next series.